So let's change the order of um, these menus and the layout uh, of these articles. This is a featured article menu item type. So let's get to the back end of the site. We will log in. And uh, first, let's go to our article manager. Go to content and article manager. And notice this star here. This is what's featuring these articles. Okay, so all three of these are featured. Um, I think first, you know, if you go to the options button in the article manager, you're going to get this um, blog featured layouts option here. And you have a few options uh, for your for how you'd like to lay out the article. And what this is, is this is a, a global setting. This will, anytime you have a featured article menu item type, I think it also affects the category blog. You'll have the same, the same view here, but you can also do this in the menu item. So if you didn't want to do it globally, let's close this. We can open up that actual menu items. So we'll go to our main menu, and you see here's our featured article menu item type. Let's open up art classes. And if we go to advanced options, I believe, we can see leading articles, columns. Let's just do one column here. And let's save and let's see what happens on the front end. So we change to one column. Now, how do we change the order? How do we change the order? In the back end, we are going to have an option somewhere. So. Um, under this details tab, we see the ordering, and here we have, oh, this list looks like for the menu itself. Under advanced, perhaps, yep, under that advanced tab, you have the article order, and you can use your global setting, and so you do have a few options here. Let me scroll down. You can use the featured articles order. Uh, right now, we're using the global setting. You can do the oldest first and, or the uh, alphabetical. With the least hits, most hits, you have a number of options here, Jim. So let's go ahead and select, um, let's do featured articles order and then save. And then let's return to the front and refresh. And we did switch a little bit. We did move around a little bit. Let's go play around with that ordering in our article manager now. So in the back end, we'll save and close. We'll go back to the article manager. And so here's our three articles. Let's filter just for, you know, I, can't, I guess we can't filter just for our featured. Um, guys, is there a way to change our ordering in the article manager right here? I think if you click, um, see up at the top, the features tab. Oh, you have to make it, that's where you choose to make it featured. That's just another Yeah, option. yeah. Yep. I'm not I seeing don't see an, an yeah, ordering. I don't see an ordering either. So select the ordering. Uh, I thought that we... Is it here? Um... See the up and down arrows, the very first column? I think you're right now, yeah. Okay, yep. So 3.0, the functionality is a little bit different than 2.5. I thought there was drag and drop. But Maybe, what happens when you click that? Yep. Yeah, now you can drag and drop. See how those boxes turn? There we go. Very good. Yep. So uh, we click the little arrows off to the right side and then... Um, enabling this allows us to drag and drop. So let's do, let's do um, dramatic acting first, drawing and sketching last, advanced sculpting in the middle. So let's go ahead and there used to be a little save icon. Let's just turn ordering off. Well, let's return to the front and see what happens. and our changes take place. So, and again, you can just go ahead and come back and play with ordering if we wanted to put a 
sculpting first, acting last, and there's no save feature. I'm but surprised there's not a save. Yeah, no. That didn't change it, did it? It saves it there, though. I mean, it saves the order here. It doesn't... Let's get back to our control panel and then come back. Just see. So it saved my order. But it didn't change it on the front page. So let's go back to the menu item here. I think one thing to note, too, with the featured article... Um, category or featured article layout is a little different than a blog layout because it allows you to have categories or articles from several different categories. Mm -hmm. So not only is your article order affected by the order of your articles itself, but also if you see above, the category order as well. So depending on how your categories are ordered, if you're pulling articles from different categories, that may be affecting it as well. So you might want to pick a different setting back here. I actually, in a few of our categories in our knowledge base, I use the um, most recent first. And let me save and close that. And then I'll go back and open up each individual article. So I'll change the date. So advanced sculpting, um, I'll come to publishing options and change this created date. So let's go back in time and say that we created this one on January 31st. Save and close. And then we'll do the same thing for the sketching here. We created this one on the 1st of February. And then lastly, dramatic acting. We can move this one. Let's just say we did this on the third. Save and close. And then if we come here, let's see if this changes anything. And that did change it. So, um, Jim, hopefully we gave you a few options for changing the order of your featured article menu item type. Let us know if there's something else we can help you with or you need a little bit more there.